Olga Tkachenko is from Pokrovsk in Ukraine's Donetsk region. She is a teacher by training and three years ago opened a kids' development studio in Ukraine. But Russia's invasion of Ukraine left her with nothing. When we got on a train to leave, a bomb fell right behind us, and I thought it was a sign. I took my kid and left in time. It took us some 30 hours to get to Lviv. Air raid sirens were blaring non-stop. Together with her son, Tkachenko came to the U.S. and headed to Philadelphia, where she has relatives who were happy to accommodate her. Right after we arrived, I started looking for a job because I was running out of money and we needed to live somehow. I called places, but I don't speak English, though I'm learning. And everyone asked about my English skills, heard I have none and said no. But then I met Vira. Vira Lach is co-owner of a Ukrainian grocery store chain near Philadelphia. Lach has been in the U.S. for over 16 years. But still, the war hit her hard. I couldn't handle it. I didn't show up at work for over two weeks. I didn't want anything, only go to Ukraine and help. But I realized it's impossible. I couldn't leave people without work, so I knew I had to be strong. In March, more Ukrainian refugees came to her for help. So Lach opened a new store in November. Now, she says, 25 Ukrainian refugees are employed at her two stores. Irina Bespeka is a refugee from the Ukrainian city of Ivano-Frankivsk. She came to the U.S. through the Unite for Ukraine program to join her brother in Philadelphia. I couldn't even hope for a manager position. I was willing to work in the kitchen. I was willing to do anything as long as I could work. But Vera just told me, you can do anything. Alexander Markevich is from Lviv. He also works at this store, helping out in the kitchen. I think anyone would love to do something that brings both joy and also pays the bills. Lach says this is how she can help, and she'll keep hiring Ukrainians as long as she can. For Irina Salomka in Philadelphia, Pennsylvania, NRI's VOA News.